Sunday fun day. Let's get ahead of the game. Load up all of our tools for day one of this quick and easy shower build. Tomorrow will be demo day. Remove a simple fiberglass surround, a steel tub, and then uh, we get going. Frame the niche, plumb our valve, install the backer board, waterproof everything in one day, and then start tile and finish tile the following day. So let's load up for demo. Hand tools. T-stack system, everything you need for prep. DeWalt big boy box. Houses all of our cordless tools, batteries, extension cords. If you haven't gone cordless, please consider investing. It speeds up the build process. Rather than dragging around cords all the time, pop a battery in and go. Air, AC unit, filter, as well as a dehumidifier, which sucks moisture when we want to waterproof and tile in one day with our curdy membrane. Dyson buckets. Bag of thinny with a wonderful hole at the bottom. Roll of curdy and of course a dustpan and broom. And of course our beast bucket liner and our quick hands, portable trash cans. Plastic here to protect the vanity and we have this cool pad to protect the vanity top, the countertop of the vanity. Again, this is a shower remodel only. The Bob DeWalt. Little cutouts for your faucet. Lay this foam right on top of the vanity and then you have a nice protective layer to place all of your remodeling tools on. And last, our plumbing box for the bathtub and the mixing valve. As you can see, this van can pack a lot of tools. We're ready to go for Monday morning. It really pays off to prepare the day before and get cracking first thing Monday. Now, the only thing we don't have is floor protection. So Lowe's blows, here we come. Let's grab some ram board here. And this is it. Shower is the only responsibility. Uh, five inch can light up there and new toilet. So we're just gonna protect everything here. Floor, vanity, rip this fiberglass out. Super simple guys. Maybe one hour demo then we head out and pick up all of our materials. Okay, demo is complete. We ripped the shower out. One little issue we've come across, we need to cut the existing bathroom floor tile so that the tub fits. Uh, we pulled out a 30 inch, we're going to install a 32 inch, so easy to do. Grinder, shop vac, and a uh, very steady hand. So let's show you the tub. This tub will sit in a mortar bed tall soaking fiberglass. And here we are folks. Laser pull ready for the laser. We have our air on. Everything's ripped out. We don't want to mess with this corner bead so we are going to just simply wrap this with our curdy membrane. Really easy right now. We're going to cut out this stud so that we can dry fit our bathtub. Mark our line where we're going to cut, which will be about there. 
and cut on that line. Install the tub, drain kit. We'll cut out this valve. We've already prepped the valve here. So let's get to it. Rough plumbing, rough framing with the niche here, but we need the tub in before we can pull measurements for the niche. Backer board, waterproof, and then we get going with tile. Let's get to work, guys. Now with this stud removed, we can easily get our new tub in to dry fit. Mark our line on the tape here and make our grinder cut. So we're gonna plane this one. This one's out about, I would say, three-eighths of an inch. All right, it's time to cut the tile. We got a shot back, grinder, obviously respirators here, so safety first.